Hey everyone, how are you doing? It's Harry here again. So today we've got this, which is a compound bow and arrow. I did the video on the crossbow recently and I thought, well, I may as well do one on the bow and arrow I've got kicking about as well. Now I got this quite a while ago, to be honest, probably at least 10 years ago. And I, so my parents didn't really want me to have it and what have you. And they said I could have it, but they were afraid I was going to shoot someone's window or something. So I was only allowed to shoot it inside the house. And I used to shoot it down the hallway. And I used to hang a bag of hay on my sister's door. And my sister's door used to get pelleted with holes from me shooting the bow and arrow. But yeah, I stopped doing that eventually. I think my parents were happy about that. But yeah. Here it is. It is a compound bow. I paid 20 quid for it a few years ago. You can still get them around. I know the range was selling them for a while. You can get them online quite easily if you want to get your hands on them. I'm not sure what they're going for nowadays or what quality they are. But here's this one. I think it might be a junior because it's not the biggest one in the world. But it's big enough for what you want for shooting targets and at home and what have you. So I've got a handle here here that's where we hold it pull our strings back when we pull the strings back if you if I set it up a bit better you'll see there how it changes that's what makes it the compound bow and that's what these other strings are doing here I'll probably do restringing to be honest because I haven't used it in a while but it's like a coated wire I think with these so it should be should be fine for that. It's just probably lost some power over the years. Also got a little sight on there, if you can see that. Which we can adjust. I don't really use it, because I normally just look down the arrow. But yeah, so that's that. So when I bought it, it came with three arrows, which were these Armex ones. I haven't got one out in a while. These here. Not pointed ends, just soft points, which is all you need. Yeah, so it came a few of them. I don't know if I said, but it's an Armex bow. What have you? So yeah, you just what you do, put your arrow in there, and you go from there. So yeah, I'll set up the target again and give it a go, and I'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, we're back. So. We've got the target set up over there. Uh, when you buy one of these, it normally comes in a kit, it normally comes with something to support your arm there. Uh, I've just got a wrap on there for the minute, just in case the string comes back and catches my arm there, because it can really hurt. So what happens is, I flip back, and you'll see the compound bow go like that. And that's what makes it a compound bow rather than a normal bow and arrow. Like that. So, there we go. Put it in the things there. Put the arrow in, like so. I'm ready to shoot. Oh, it off. And then flip on the other arrow. Like so. Try a wooden arrow. I don't like using these as much because they break a lot easier and they're a lot thicker as you can probably see there. They don't go in as well. Let's try one anyway. Some close up shots, shall we?
so there we have our compound bow a good bit of fun as you can see they do bounce back every now and then so it's always good to wear protection where possible they go in quite far into the hay bag it's not too bad really but i think if i had a newer string on the boat go a lot further in be a bit more powerful but as is about 10 years old now this thing 20 quid it's lasted well and it's good fun to have really yeah so i really enjoy using this when i can the weather's nice in the summer so yeah there we have it our little compound bow so, thank you very much for watching guys as always if you like this video please hit the like button and we've got a few more videos like this on the channel so if you go have a look at them feel free and whilst you're on the channel if you subscribe i'd really appreciate that too so that's the end of this video and until the next one hopefully i'll see you then goodbye for now